Hello, John Lampy here. We're going to be doing some control on a plant called common toad flax or butter and eggs. It's a little hard to see because it's windy, but uh, you can uh, see what the plant looks like. This one has flowered. Some of it has gone to seed. So the first thing I'm going to do is cut off some of the tops uh, to make sure that we don't uh, let the plant go to seed after we apply some herbicide to it. So I'm going to just do this to this entire patch here and then I'm going to do an herbicide application. So there's a fair amount of it here, not a huge patch, but I want to get it under control. There's some that has gone to seed. So we want to make sure we control it as much as possible. So first off I'm going to just nip off the tops throw them in a bag and then leave enough so that we can treat it. Okay so now I have cut off the tops. There's one more and uh, put them in this bag and we'll dispose of that. Don't want the seeds. I want to prevent spreading those seed as much, seeds as much as possible. So now we're going to do an application. We're just going to use the Green Shoats Foam Herbicide application. We've got a, uh, it's got Kills All 2 in it, and we've got a uh, pretty high label rate so that we can apply to these plants. And we're going to do a selective application. So we're just going to apply the tops of these and that foam herbicide will then gradually go down the plant. Now it doesn't matter a lot. We've got mostly creeping charlie here so it's not so critical that uh, we get a perfect application but if you did have other plants nearby you'd want to be as precise as possible 